Hello everyone. So last lecture, we see how to implement option menu in Android. So in today's lecture, we will see how to implement context menu in Android. So first start Android Studio. Then select new project. You name to your select empty view activity. Then give name to your application. Say context menu and click on finish. After creating that particular new project, you will see two files that is activity main.xml, where that is the design view in which you have to put all the particular XML controls. And second one will be the main activity.java. Here we have to write the particular logic. Okay. So first create the particular resource directory in resource folder. That is our design view. In design view, we have the one text view. So first set its properties. So click on it, then go to the attributes, set its ID, set text view one. Then change the particular text. Say long press. So what we have to perform when we have we click on that particular button long time at that time some items must be get displayed say cut copy and paste okay. so to perform that particular one first create a particular resource directory in resource folder so right click on resource folder then click on new and add a resource directory then in new resource directory, select resource type as a main and click on OK. See, a one new folder will be get added under the resource directory. Now we have to create a particular resource file. So right click on menu, click on new and create a new resource file, menu resource file. Give the particular name, say context menu. As you can see, there is one file will be get appear before that particular one. We have the two files activity main.xml and main activity.java. Now new file will be get what enter there. That is a context menu.xml. That is the file where we have to create the particular menu. So how many items that we have to display when we click on that particular button, these items that we have to add in that particular context menu. So go to the coding view and add items there. So to add the particular item, we have the tag that is called as item with that particular item tag. We have to set two properties. That is the ID say item one and second property will be title. Say cut. So when we long press on that particular button, that particular cut copy or paste must be get appear. And that is the title that we have to set. So we require say three items cut copy and so create the three different items, change their ID, say I1, I2 and say I3 and then cut then copy and next option will be paste. That's it in our what XML file. So we created a particular menu. Now we have to link that particular menu with our Java file. So come to the Java file. First here we have to create the particular object of text view because in activity main.xml we have the text view. So when we click the, the long click on that particular text view, some items will be get displayed. So text view, say v1. Now link that particular one with a particular control that we have into the what main activity.xml. So v1 is equal to text view. 
then link that particular one will be the with the control that we have with activity main.xml so find view by id r dot id dot what name that we give that is a text view one then we have to write one method that is a on create context menu so write that particular method and here we have to inflate call the particular inflate method that is a get menu inflator dot inflate so now when we click on that particular one what we have to display we have to display that particular context menu so pass that particular context menu file as a parameter so first one will be the r dot menu dot context menu and second parameter will be the object of menu of uh, class say menu so that's it and what next that we have to do does we have to register that particular what control for context menu so the we have to call a one method that is called as register for context menu and pass parameter as a v1 that is the object that we created and we link that particular one with a particular text view into the activity map. So when we run the particular program, application is successfully run and see when we long press on that particular element. So some functionality will be get open. That is a cut copy paste and that is the concept of context menu in Android Studio. If you like the particular video, then share it and subscribe it. Thank you.